Now at 5 o'clock, Columbia Gas sentenced for causing the devastating explosion in the Merrimack Valley two years ago. Today, a federal judge ordered the gas company to pay a criminal fine of more than $53 million for the explosions and the fires that damaged more than 100 homes and took one life as well. WBZ's Paula Evan is here now with a look at what else is in that sentence. Paula? Well, David, the amount of the fine was no surprise. Back in February, Columbia Gas agreed to plead guilty and pay $53 million for violating the Pipeline Safety Act. Today, the judge also sentenced the company to a three-year probation period during which it will be monitored. Authorities blame Columbia Gas for failing to account for critical pressure sensors as workers replaced old cast iron pipes in Lawrence. That omission caused high pressure gas to flood into neighborhoods causing the explosions. Most of the 53 million will not go directly to those impacted, but will instead go into the Justice Department's Crime Victims Fund. Now, in a statement, Lawrence Mayor Dan Rivera said, I hope that U.S. Attorney Andrew Lulling and other federal leaders can find a way to make that $53 million fine help the families in the impacted communities. It is clear now more than ever that the people of Lawrence, Andover, and North Andover would have more use for this money than the federal government. After the plea deal was announced in February, Eversource agreed to buy Columbia's Massachusetts natural gas assets for $1.1 billion. Federal authorities said the three-year probation period will last until Columbia Gas is sold. David and Lisa.